Well, howdy soldiers, cold me 247 here at part 25 of the Stainless Steel Crusader States campaign. Um, what we're going to do today, I told you last part, we are waiting for the Fatimid faction leader to come over and try to siege Jerusalem. And we will finish him badly. Um, and we are advancing another army that's here. I'm going to wipe out this little force of rebels. And we're going to keep advancing towards probably I don't think we'll make it to Baghdad before the uh, Empire uh, the Imperial faction air well the Holy Roman Empire I don't think we'll get there before them so we'll get this fight going and then I might embark into the campaign uh, into the crusade because the Pope is asking for it um, by the way the Pope is a female it's a woman <laughs> Nobody noticed in, 50, in 52 years that this is a woman. That's pretty cool. That's pretty... I don't know. <laughs> I guess people in the Middle Ages didn't have their eyes open or something. Um, so we're training more troops. We got a lot of stuff that is right now uh, retrain. I got new units. That's all. Re that's the three units that are retrained. I might be sending them out, but my other idea is to keep keep them here and then regroup them with the rest of my army as soon as we're done with the Jihad and then take Damietta and eventually take Al Aqaba also. We have to take those to finish the campaign if you look at the campaign goal here. Uh, Jerusalem, Cairo, and we have to elim- oh I have to take Cairo. Ah, but we'll, we're gonna be fighting the Hungarian at the end. Um, and we have to eliminate the Fatimid Caliphate. So we'll attack the Fatimid. And then after that we'll get rid of the Hungarians right here. You, d you will not have time to, you know, retaliate. And this is going to be the end of the campaign. We're not playing a long campaign on this because a long campaign will take so much time. We're going to turn 50. Turn 50, folks. Uh, thank you, by the way, for following this campaign. I know you guys really like it. I like it. Stainless steel is a great mode. It's nice and solid. It works very well. Um, that's all I have to say. I mean, it's just a lot of fun. I might be doing... Oh, uh, no, he's not going to siege for real. Look like we're going to have to move the troops out. Yeah, he's going to siege. Oh, look at that stack. Just pass by. Just pass by. Get Go, go away. Go away. <laughs> I don't want to fight more. I am. I'm busy. I'm busy. I got two other fights going on. Look how fast this guy's going. It's crazy. And he made it to Baghdad. Oh, almost. He didn't make it, but almost. He's gonna siege Baghdad. So that's to punish the Turks that are attacking me for a while. We'll uh, we'll remove their capital. That's it. So if the the Holy Roman Empire most likely will take this capital pretty easily. Oh, don't move it. it uh, oh, we have an husband. Yeah, great. The king of Portugal is dead. The king of Norway is dead. Every year there's three kings dying. We are done with the gallows. And Acre, I have the market. Alright, so we'll keep going here. Um, can we grow this city? We'll make more cash with the farms. I'll do that. In Gaza. There's not much I can build. I gotta tell you. Um, is it possible for me to retrain anything? No. He is not sieging Alexandria. So this will give us maybe an opportunity to... I, I might move an army here just to, you know, get him nervous. And he's gonna turn around. Let's look at what's inside this. He's got good troops. He, he's got decent troops. Those javelin men are pretty terrible. I gotta tell you guys. If we get siege, what do we have? Wow, it's not going to be the biggest defense we ever had. Um, let's put some troops in there. I'll put a catapult, more spears, and more marinades. And with some, a bit of a luck, he's not going to siege me. Or he might join the jihad with this army and then turn around. That'd be good. That'd be really good. Um, Even if they do not deserve it, 
I will offer the infidels a fair fight. Always the same there speech. Will be much honor in defeating you, noble infidel. So he's sending the faction leader and the faction here in the same army. We're gonna wait for him to get on my city and try to siege it. He can't get it in one turn. He's gonna siege it for one turn at least. No, yep. He's gonna siege it for one turn and we're gonna attack this army and wipe it out. That's the goal. Um, I'm gonna move everything I can out of this place to Gaza. Gaza, here we go. And then we'll be taking, we're doing a new army in Gaza, that's for sure. Archers. Hmm, they're not really good. Um, I'm gonna add some of those. I, I only have two play two spots. Spearmen or oh, archers. Archers, they're better. <laughs> Believe it or not, they are. <laughs> uh, I have another spot though. Cavalry is really good. I, even though it's not the best cavalry ever, it's good. Um, let's do another machine just for fun. So we'll have a ballista and see how we're gonna work with this. Hopefully, Alexandria will not be sieged this turn. We're done with the construction report. We're waiting for the siege here. We're gonna wipe out this little rebel army. I'm auto resolving this, by the way. We lost 38 men, that's it. Alright. That's right. Peace in the desert. And we're going to Quarizia. I don't know if it's. I really don't know if it's the place I have to attack to maybe stop this jihad, but that's where I'm going now. Um, we are. All we have to do is wait for the turn. I will put a tower here, though. There's no tower in the middle of this desert. Let's put one. We, setting up a watchtower. They actually build cool-looking towers you know, made of rocks and everything. If you look at some documentaries about the Crusades and, you know, more maybe about the Templar Knights or about... Yeah, that's... Look into, look into some Crusades uh, um, documentaries or um, castles in the Holy Lands and you'll see what it looks like. It's really... Uh, there's a lot of cool things. I'll put more troops here. Jerusalem is well defended. I don't need more troops. I'll put another unit of marine just in case we need it. So we'll be waiting for the siege. Excellent. I'm happy with that. I will be recruiting another boat. Add more war galleys to my fleet. We're gonna use the assassin. Again, that's a trick. You wanna train your assassin. Right now we're level 3. You wanna train your assassins. Find rebel armies that are not bugging you and then train on them. And eventually you get levels. On this one we didn't get anything. But if I play a little bit I'll get to le maybe level 4 or 5. Which is really good. Um, and then we can kill some of the merchants. We can kill priests. Um, I'm just going to look at a mission because I'm not sure. The poor unbelievers. Center press 66. We're at 63. I'll put two in the city. It might be faster if I put them in the city. I am not sure of that. I think just staying there is okay. Um, that's the move for today. We're moving here. So next turn we can actually siege uh, Quarizia. So he's better. He better train some troops. I am still. A bit scared for Alexandria. If he takes it back, I mean, good for him. Because I don't have the best troops here. But if he takes it back, that's just good for him. We'll move back here. You're not telling me that I can't recruit anything here. Oh, yeah. Oh, I don't want boats. I don't need boats. Nope. Impossible to recruit anything. Go back. That is all moving out next turn. That might actually be this turn. No, there's a lot of units that I can't move far. But we'll wait. Let's skip the turn to turn 51. He's gonna siege. 
Jerusalem, as predicted right now. And I think that if we kill them both in one battle, our enemy lays siege to our settlement, mon yeah, roi. if we kill them both in one battle, oh yeah, we have the Sicilian joining the crusade, that's nice. And that made his, oh, his army turn around, oh yes, his army turned, I'm happy. We're not going to lose Alexandria, well, not, not in the next turns for sure. That's excellent. So I think we... Uh, I'm just coming back to this. I think that if we attack this army and kill the faction leader and the faction heir at the same time, this is the end of the Fatimids, I think. So we'll have the Fatimids eliminated and we'll be fighting maybe rebels for a little bit because I need more territories to win the campaign. But I think we'll be fighting uh, right after this battle. We'll be fighting rebels. That's it. The Fatimids will be gone. Uh, still waiting for more action. How many kings or, you know, faction leaders will die this turn? The king of England is dead. Ah, that's sad. Alright, that's the only sad thing. Mission success. I got an, a thousand florin. My money is going down, by the way, now. For those of you uh, telling me maybe I, I, I have enough. No, I don't. I never have enough. Edessa. Uh, there's no way we can make more cash with Edessa. Uh, uh, we're not building anything. Aleppo. Time time to get the markets. In Alexandria, the market is done. I'm gonna hurt him. I think I'm gonna put an abbey there. No, I'll put the ship right. We'll make a bit more cash. And we can trade better boats. I, 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 we need to build better boats. Excellent. So we can get to our fight. Before that... I'm gonna move my army. Excellent. So all of this, you, 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 you don't move. And I'll just move. I think I'm moving towards Alakaba right now. That'd be a good idea. I'm gonna put it halfway, like right here. Oh, you join this. Join this. So we can we can have fun with one of those. Um. Training troops done. A, card a cardinal dies. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. Let's uh, let's recruit more troops if it's possible. Uh, we got spearmen. Ooh, Syrian auxiliaries are bad. I gotta say, they're not good. Um, what else are we gonna build in this place? Uh, I will put a stone mason at. Oh yeah, stone mason hot right now. So that's done. Army's yeah. on the way. I'm going to Alakaba. Damieta we can take. It's not a big problem. Oh, here here comes another Oh my god. This is never gonna stop. So let's do the important thing today, folks. Whoa! The computer will be controlling this part. Uh, because I can't control it. I already have my maximum units. He's got no chance to get out of this. Let's find this on the battle map. Yep. And if he get captured, uh, well, there's no ransom. I'm sorry. I will execute him right away. So we will be done with them. I want to see the result. I'm interested in the battle, but I want to see the result. That's really what I want to see right now. Um, we're gonna start deployment right now. So this is a pretty decisive fight, I gotta tell you. Pretty decisive. Everything must be done well. Yep, I always put my cavalry on the same side. Always. I don't I don't play with this guys. Uh, and javelins are good against cavalry when he's sending it. We'll start the battle. I'm, I'm on the right side, excellent. Alright. We'll take those four units of knights. Knights of Jerusalem, Hospitaliers, and Crusader Knight or Templar Knights, sorry. Get on the offensive, you. You can still control, by the way, use this. Shootout stance, defensive stance, or aggressive stance. They're going aggressive because I want the, the fight to finish. Um, 
they will not be of much help. What we're gonna do is try to keep the cavalry. So make sure that our archers are shooting on the right units. Numidian spearmen, spearmen, spear militia. All right. So I'm gonna try to kill the Fetzmid Caliphate, right? I'm gonna let them charge, actually. So they're really stuck. He's... Uh, no. But okay, you can shoot at this, I don't care. The thing is, I don't wanna just start shooting at this unit. And then all of a sudden they run. That's just not good. We have to hit the... That big unit. Flame him. <laughs> Burn him. I would have needed my cavalry on the other side right now. We're sending it on the other side. A little bit of a delay, but that's okay. I need to charge this unit and make sure I wipe it out. Burn him. Well, it's not really French army, that's why they say Armée de la France. Go, 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 shoot. Get your swords out. Two arms. Our men are winning the battle. Of course if we are. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. I'm still shooting at the right unit on this, this other side. And those two units will go to the back right now. Quick, quick, quick. You can't run. Get another charge. Where is he now? We got one. I changed my missile. I'm gonna move this unit out. I think we got the faction air. Only half the enemy force remains. Yep, we're wiping it out. I'm doing a, a bit of a triangle here on the side. We're trying to make sure that his, the Caliphate doesn't run. Everybody's engaged in the fight. Yep. Time for the fight. Time for the last charge. I will kill him. He's almost alone now. Run. So we got a bit of a backup. The king is slain. A we got enemy, it. But no less dead for that. We must press our advantage. Press and finish this. That's it. 
That's a win, folks. We got both of them. And we're gonna go just finish the uh, ballista that's really far there. We'll leave that to the hospitalers. I have a small unit of Crusader Knights done here. Go back to the general. That was Templars, by the way. Oh, you're not running away. Nobody's running away here. That's right, kill them. We'll look at the hospitalers finish it. The beautiful sun. I'm happy with this fight, that's why I'm not talking. We did good. And we're gonna look at the charge. This uh, from the back of the enemy, I like this. The battle. Run down I will continue battle. I always do that. Experience is important and to make sure also that nothing's coming back. We wiped it out. Done. So the rest of my cavalry will be helping. Don't worry, this is not going to be really long. There's only three units here. He's sending cavalry on it. We'll do the same thing, make sure it's all done. There you go. We'll look at Knight's fight for now. Freaking bush. Get on my way. Oh, we're done with the unit, we just trampled it. You see how much experience I have on my knights? They will be retrained, by the way. That's just really... it's nasty having those. Uh, where are you going? I have a couple of I apparently have a unit running here. You got it? Or not? Yep, it's dead. And I have another one in the middle of that somewhere. Apparently. Where is it now? Oh, it's there. We'll send the king. And the knights of Jerusalem, because they're pretty cool. I'm sending all my knights. Done. So this will be running. We'll put that on fast forward. He's got one guy surviving this. Where is it now? No, no, that's alright, Crusaders go there. Here we go. Finish down on fast forward. Um, I don't think he managed to escape with any unit. I'm not sure. But I don't see anything in the field here. Nope. I don't think he, he did not escape with anything. It's complete a complete wipeout. And we have the Knights of Jerusalem taking care of this last unit. Yay! This is an act heroic which only belongs to men of great virtue and valor. Yep, magnifique, I would say. A l great work. We're going back on the battle map. Oh, uh, let's see the result here. We kill the Caliphate. They all get executed. That's what I said before I started the battle. Bye bye. Oh, there is a lot here. Relation report. Caliphate is dead. God be praised for this the Caliphate is dead. The Caliphate is dead again. Because we killed the heir. Um, so he's got another Caliphate somewhere, I guess. He's got another boss somewhere. That's alright. That's alright, because I'm just going to retrain my troops now. Uh, let's just see here. Would I be able to reach... I'll, I'll put my Knight Templars back in. I have three units of those. Put them back in. I have all these sepulchres that need to be retrained. Let's see here what we can retrain. All these we can always retrain, that's nice. I'll wait for that. Um, I might be just putting my knights all together and do one squad with them. Your will, Orders. And yes, eventually, they lose experience. Wh whatever way you do it, they lose experience. Unless I'm I'm, I'm not really aware of that, Orders. but whatever way you do you do it, they lose experience. Alright. That 
That is a pretty cool part. So, when you guys come back into the next part, what are we gonna do into the next part? Next part, we do have... Hold on. You have big holes in there. I gotta patch this up. And quick. Uh, you are not super trained. Let's go here. See if we can retrain those. No, we can't. Where did I get those horsemen from? Templar Foot Knights? Ah, no, I sent them to the wrong spot. They're supposed to be here. Yeah. Alright, we'll move them back. Hold on. Make sure I don't forget. Alright. What about the rest? I'm gonna take part of this here. We have really good unit here. One, two. What else are we gonna take? We'll take this. It's gonna go there. This army. I will keep where it is. Yep. So what we're doing now is we'll take the don't don't worry, that army is not gonna be there on time. We'll have time to, you know, remake our army here. Um it's all about really my triangle, so Acre, Geza, Kerak that are sending troops to help. So make sure you watch the next part because we'll take a break here on this part 25. Part 26, most likely we will stop this uh, jihad by attacking Quarizia. And if it's not the right place, I'll attack another city right after. So we'll clean up the Turks and we'll, we'll stop them. Um, the Holy Roman Empire will take Baghdad for sure. If you look so far, it, it looks like it's going to happen. Um, so it might be finally the end of this jihad. If I get Qu uh, Quarizia here quick, uh, there's no more jihad, so this army here is just lost and will not be doing anything. So, thank you all for watching this part. Uh, don't forget guys to give a thumbs up on this video if you like it, so press the like button. Uh, don't forget also your comments down below. Thank you all again for watching and have a good one, soldiers.